Hello players, gamers, or viewers. This is Mr. Roblox Indonesia. And today I want to talk about the development of Escape Velocity. First of all, I fucked up. Like literally, the game or the current update, the transition periods, was supposed to be finished in November last year. But it got postponed many times, to the point now that it has reached the end of spring. For context, the transition periods was a series of updates that began from transition period 1 to transition period 333 or 9. This update was supposed to change or revamp some of the mechanics and maps of the game, while also adding some important core mechanics for the future. The first and second transition periods were smooth sailing, but then a problem occurred, and it was not the development, but the devlog series. I made a mistake by making the devlog series after the updates were released. And in case some of you guys didn't know, the making of one devlog video took longer than the development of the game. Which caused a huge slowdown in development. Second, I'm too ambitious about the game and also an idiot. The thing is that I'm just an amateur game dev with a lack of game design skills, art skills, animation skills. VFX skills, and mainly programming skills. Even though I have learned some of this stuff, that isn't enough to create my ambitious game in Roblox. I still need more to learn and more experience. I don't want this ambitious game to get jaggy, broken, and unpolished because of my stupidity. Then you guys suggest, why not hire or make someone do it for you? Well, the thing is that, First, I don't have enough money. And second, I want this to be my solo project from start to finish. Yes, it would help speed up the process. But in terms of learning as a developer, probably not. I have so many projects after this ambitious game is finished. And because those projects were done solo, why not use this as a learning project as well? Also, it would be cool to see that there's a solo developer that creates an ambitious game especially in Roblox. So, in conclusion, this feels like writing an essay. I decided that after transition period 9, I would hold the development of Escape Velocity and start making some simple or little games in Roblox. The goal was to learn more about game programming, design, art, animations, and VFX, while also giving me some experience as a game developer. I'm sorry for those gamers of Escape Velocity that have been waiting for updates for years, even though the fanbase is less than 5 people. But don't worry, I will be back with some more experience and knowledge than before. Anyway, that's pretty much it. Thanks for reading.